got to the elephant sanctuary in Phuket. Nate's first question was how big are the poos of the elephants? Well, you gotta ask the important ones, right? <laughs> by a guy who originally had elephants in the tourism industry and then he his elephant got injured so he wanted to retire her and send her somewhere that she'd be taken care of he went to the Chiang Mai elephant nature park and was inspired by the woman who started that one that was caring for them so he started this one as well with the goal of getting um, 25 elephants over 30 acres they own right now but it's, it's all open and they don't have fences or anything so they can roam however they want and they have I think they're each assigned a um, mahout um, to watch them and care for them and guide them into like the water therapy and into the jungle for food and all that stuff. Katie's about to get her first test run with feeding the elephant. More. Is it cool? <laughs> the sanctuary is relatively new, and so they're in the process of constructing this over this uh, skywalk. So eventually, I think that's where everyone who comes and visits will be at, but right now we still get to explore on the ground. Wow, whole watermelon. More watermelon. Oh my God. I know. Just shove it in there and eat all of it. Poo -poo. <laughs> the poo poo floats. This sanctuary opened up in 2016 and it was the first um, ethical sanctuary to open up in Phuket at the time. I think it might still be the only one. Um, but they're looking to expand and awareness about the situation it continues to increase, which is good. So hopefully we continue to see more and more improvement with this. During the presentation that they showed us at the beginning of the tour, um, they were saying that about 100 years ago there was approximately 100,000 elephants, both wild and captive, in Thailand. And at this point now there's less than 7,000. So hopefully we can see that number rise in the next couple years um, as people become more and more aware of what's going on and, and we start to make a difference. All the elephants, I think there's 12 or 14 right now, um, are all female and they said that it's a lot harder to rescue males because of their tusks and also they have their ability to procreate their entire life, um, whereas females they kind of have a, a time frame when they can reproduce and then at, after which they're pretty much um, useless. Yeah, they're not taken care of anymore um, and that's when these sanctuaries swoop in and, and rescue them and then basically take care of them for the rest of their lives. So the one on the left here, um, she's blind. So the one on the right, they're like best friends and they go to everywhere together, they eat together, they bathe together, they sleep in the same enclosure together. Um, the one on the right pretty much just looks after her all the time. It's pretty sweet. On a daily basis, these elephants eat over 300 kilograms worth of fruits and vegetables and leaves and bamboo. So, the largest one eats over 300 kilograms. It's basically almost, it's basically almost 700 pounds. <laughs> All right, we just got done eating lunch, and that'll about wrap up our tour here at the Elephant Sanctuary. Um, we only did the half-day tour just because we have to catch a ferry to get to PP to this evening. Um, but they do have full-day tour options available if that's what you want to do. I would have loved to have done that. Um, I think they, you, get a little bit more time with the elephants and. 
um, get to just kind of interact with them in their natural habitats a little bit more than what we got to see. But regardless, it was really, really cool, really neat experience. Um, we learned a ton, uh, came away with a lot of really useful information. Uh, I definitely recommend checking this out, especially if you're in Phuket, which most people go to, or at least are around this area when they come and visit Thailand. Um, from everything I see, it seems like a very ethical uh, sanctuary and I'm glad that we supported it. So that'll wrap things up, signing out.